Last time on Chicory, a colorful tale. We got through a couple of chapters, fought a couple of bosses. This is our latest outfit. <laughs> and we, um, our, our character is not Chicory. Chicory is like the other painter that we're trying to coach and help through their depression, their anxiety, their imposter syndrome. They are really down on themselves, so we're trying to help them. Time to get cozy. Yeah, let's do it. This way to continue. Oh, we just finished redecorating our room. Check this out. I love it. We got the sweet furniture set. And this portrait Chicory drew for us, which I love. And we made the peace sign stamp a couple of streams ago. So we're putting it everywhere. Let's look at our map. Here's our map. We went to the swamp. That was the last boss, right? And then actually I think we need to go talk to Chicory because the boss in Gulp Swamp looked like her. And the other painter, the, the mentor, that used to be the, the head painter before Chicory took over. Um, she was like, oh, there's something wrong with Chicory. She's the reason that the world is losing its color. Like all this stuff that I just don't believe is true. Sometimes you're on when I do dinner. It's nice having you in the background. Oh, thanks. I'll be lurk while I head home and freshen up in dinner. Sounds good, Adam. Thanks for stopping in. So we want to go back up to... Oh, Wielder Tower. I think that's where we're going. We need to paint some more stuff. Here's the peace sign. Oop. And I'm gonna have to remember the controls for everything. Whee! Alright, let's go. Oh, and we learned to um, swim through our paint last stream, and our paint glows in the dark. I forget if we have another ability. Chicory, you in here? Hey. Content warning. This game has incredible content warnings. The mods and myself will let you know when they start and stop. This is for self-hate, disparaging, mental illness, and that is it. Those two things are what the game has called out. So heads up, that's going to come up here. Good mythical morning. Hi, Starburst. Welcome in. Swim through paint? Splatoon? Yeah. When does Splatoon 3 come out? Very soon. Love a game with a warning. Absolutely. It's helpful for stream. It's so helpful for stream. Next month? Yeah. Oh, hey, seafood. Did you take care of the swamp then? Chicory? I saw something. You were there in the swamp. And you said some things that. Blackberry thinks it's connected to you. But it wasn't real, right? Chicory! It's gonna be okay. Thank you, Eric. Hi, Eric. Appreciate it so much. Blackberry said that, huh? Guess there's no point in hiding it anymore. Chicory, what? What's going on? I'm a messed up person. That's what's going on. You're not all the corruptions. They're not just connected to me. They're coming from inside me. I can't stop them. They expose all my worst thoughts and fears, reveal awful things. But that's not real, right? You said there that I'm a joke and I don't deserve the brush. But that's not what you really think, right? 
You think I should be the wielder. You believe in me. Don't you? I can't deal with this. But I don't care who the wielder is. It doesn't matter. Just leave me alone. How can you say that? I did it for you. I thought we could be friends. I can't believe I looked up to you. Ouch. No seafood, it's gonna be okay. Chicory, I'm sorry. Just go away. I shouldn't have said go. No! This is so sad. I'm gonna see if there's dialogue after this and then I think the content warning will be over. It's locked. Yeah, no, no dialogue. Okay. We are out of the dialogue cutscene with the content warning. Oh, that hurts. Oh, look at us. Taking a little snooze standing up. Thank you, Eric. We were able to read the first three portraits here. I wish I could read the other ones. This is a cat horse? Am I seeing that wrong? Hippo? I don't know. Koala, maybe? Slug? Uh, what is this? <laughs> Stick figure. No matter which portrait you pick, it says the same things. Really? Oh, hi, Moko Mom. Welcome in. I wish that it said different ones. The portraits are so fun. This is where we started the game. I haven't been back in a while. I don't think there's anything to do in here, but it's still nice. I don't like that the music is gone. Chicory, I'm sorry. Oh, now what? <gasps> what? <laughs> I'm having a letter delivered to me by bugs. Dear Wielder, the bugs of feast humbly request your service. Come find us deep in the grub caverns, on the outskirts of dinners, the North City. Sincerely, Queen Drosera. Hehe, <laughs> gotcha. They're so cute. We just got a letter. <laughs> but how? He's with me, Bugs, yeah. More than one Bugs. Let's talk to some people around town and then we'll head up there. Luncheon's definitely changing. I noticed these spooky trees all around. I'm a tough guy though, so it doesn't bother me. But maybe for someone less tough, it'd be scary. Aw, oh, you know what? I'm... I ain't being real right now. Look, I don't know how to say this, but I think I should be telling more people. On account of it being on my mind a lot. I like dudes, okay? I mean, not just dudes. I like all kinds of folks. So I'm bi, okay? This is a new thing for me. Anyway, so I've only recently been figuring that out about myself. It's pretty scary not to be the person you thought you were. I keep falling back on saying I'm a tough guy, but actually I'm a lot of things. Oh my god. <laughs> Including by, I guess. But also still tough. <sighs> Feels good to just be honest about it. Uh, sorry if that was weird. Not weird! Very cute, very wholesome. Figuring out your identity is tough. <laughs> 
share with whoever you feel comfortable sharing with. I love this character. This is Macaroon. By Pride. Hi Shilohs, welcome in. I love this game. It's a lot of fun. There's a lot of... I feel like I've skipped too much. There's so many characters and... Um... You exhaust the dialogue options, then you come back later and they have more. Big Kanji Tatsumi vibes from Persona 4. <laughs> Love that pride emote. That one... Where did I find that one? I don't know, it's a BTTV emote. We have a whole bunch of BTTV pride emotes. Ruogs is the person who... I got all the little, like, individual pride hearts for different flags from. And they stream too, you should go check them out. Alright, Basil says, Wielding the brush must be overwhelming. If you're not sure what to do, don't be afraid to ask for help. Old folks like us are always full of advice, haha. -ha. The way to Nipple Tunnel is through my little garden. It connects us to potluck and dinners, so folks are often coming and going through here. I hope my flowers make their trip a little nicer. It does, thank you. Very cute. I don't want to go through that tunnel quite yet. Can I go through here? I don't think so. Hi! P! We've been hearing so much about you, seafood. Yeah! At first I thought it was weird that you'd be the wielder, but now it's kind of cool. Our neighbor is the wielder, wowee! And you're talking to us, it's like we're famous! What P means is that we're happy for you. Have you found yourself settling into a style? Or are you still experimenting? It's good to mix things up even when you're comfortable. Psh. You should just find the, at the best art style and do that. If I was the wielder, it'd be easy, yeah? <laughs> Maybe we'll see you around, seafood. Yeah. If you do anything cool, I'll definitely want to go check it out. Good luck. Pick the best art style? Yeah, okay, tell me tell me the best art style. <laughs> Y'all are cute, though. My favorite is Cozy Gay. Is that a BTTV? I don't know that one. It sounds perfect. Oh, hmm. What a nicely balanced style for our home. A mix of detail and simplicity. Very pleasing. I guess. It's fine. <laughs> can I do... Like, can I do this? Yeah. And fill in all the little gaps. There you go. I like it. Oh, I just went up here. I got turned around. Let's go back. We have room for more BTTV emotes. We have a lot of BTTV emotes. <laughs> if there's any that we're missing that you really want, though, we could trade some out. Oh, it's so nice, Ghost. Yeah, it's really chill. It has a lot of, um, options, too. If you want to skip the bosses completely and just do coloring book mode, you can. But the story's really, really lovely. Mental health message. The bosses are kind of bullet hell-y, but they're pretty, they're super forgiving. Kind of bullet hell, kind of undertale-y. Magus, hi, welcome in. <laughs> we had some different schedule stuff this week, yeah. Things are just getting worse all the time. I'm trying to calm down a bit, but those horrible trees are sprouting closer and closer to me. What am I supposed to do about that? Nobody's taking this as seriously as they should. First the color wipe, now spooky trees. It's like everything is crashing down around us. Luncheon was supposed to be a safe place. 
I keep telling myself it's gonna be okay, but it's hard to make myself believe it. Oh, it'll be okay. Chai, it's good to see you. Oh, have a good one, ghost. Take care. Have a good, have a good Friday. Happy weekend. Chai, thank you for redeeming human kindness, sending human kindness from me to you, to all of chat. Thank you for being here. I appreciate you. Happy Friday. All the best weekend vibes. You are loved. You are appreciated. You are worthy. You are so much more than that. Thanks for redeeming that, Chai. Are a lot of these characters named... They're all named after food items. Every single character. Yep. Or edible things. Oh, we... So... <laughs> Fun backstory. There's a character named Karkala in this game. And when it came up, and I think, um, because Michelle, Stella Michelle is streaming this too, Widgie's streaming this too, and Michelle and me both were like, oh, Karkala, the streamer. I know her. And we went and talked to her in her stream the other day, and we're like, do you know that, did you get your name from this character? Did you know this character exists? And I thought Karkala was a flower, not an edible thing. And Karkala, the person, was like, yeah, yeah, it's it's a flower, but it's also a food item in some countries. And no, she didn't get it from this game. No connection. She had already made her username long, long ago, which I knew that too, but it was a fun, fun backstory moment. <laughs> Just lurking quietly, but thought we deserved human kindness. Thank you, Chai. Of course. This game is going on my playlist. Yes. Spread the word of wholesome chicory. Oh, I love this place. This is Oats, the shop vendor, and you get to try on different outfits to get... What do we get? New items? Do we get trash? We collect trash in this game. Tough and fancy. Do we have anything with the word fancy in it? I don't think so. Or tough. I don't know that we have that yet. Is this tough? The cowboy outfit? Maybe? Most of them so far have been really forgiving. In that they have the name of what it is they're looking for in the actual item. Hi, Cola. Hey, mate. Want to update your shirt design? Um, no, I'm good for now. Thanks. You doing okay, seafood? You're looking pretty down. It's that obvious, huh? Ha. You've always got your heart on your sleeve. Well, you know. If wielder stuff gets too stressful, you can always come back and work at the cafe again. Remember those days? Thanks, Cola. I appreciate it. Oh, this is the same. Skip, skip, skip. Oh, <laughs> if you must know, I'm writing a book. It takes a lot of focus and effort to do. And it's very hard with someone bothering you. <laughs> I came to Legend because I've been stuck on my book. But there's so much creative energy here. My ideas are finally flowing again. You're an artist. Surely you understand. Yeah, okay. It's been on list for so long time. I might as well play it now. Yeah. I have different lists for games. One is wish, one is play, one is... I don't know about this. I like that. Yeah, good, good organizational system. Hi, Sankari. Welcome in. How are you? Let's go this way. Yeah. <gasps> Can I get another uh furniture set? Hey, check it. The kids have helped me move more stuff out. If you want some, it's yours. Spooky set. Camp set. Antique set. Oh. How are you going to make me choose between those? 
I hope we can get them all. I really like Antique Set. That wasn't even an option before. Zucchini gives me the vibe of, well, actually. <laughs> Been incredibly frustrated, got a new phone after eight years and have to set up everything. Ooh, that's always a chore. I hope it goes okay. Many things on my list, I'll work it out. Mm -hmm. My Steam library is organized by whether it has achievements or not, and then three levels of interest. Do you, you use the, like, the folders? I need to do that. My wish list is organized by... It has... The top section is all just normal wish lists in order of, like, when I want to play, how much I want to play something. Usually it's things for stream, and then there's a huge chunk of my wish list that's games that are not out yet. And then I think the bottom ends up being, like, stuff that I haven't organized yet. I actually think there's only two sections. By genre. Cool. Refuse to get a new one every year or two. It was perfectly working all the time, but now came to a halt. It was necessary. I feel that, yeah. I had the same phone for a long time, too. Like, six years, maybe? And I replaced it last year. Don't organize Steam, I should. I should too, I didn't even think of that. Huh. Collections, yeah. All right, let's get the antique set. Doo -doo -doo. All right, I'll be watching the kids inside. If you find five more, I'll move more stuff out. Oh, look at all the kids. You can pet the cats. It's like a little cat cafe. Uh, and they're all the different colors of the different areas that we found them in. Oh, I love them. You need a purple carpet. Beautiful. And now I'm a paint blob. This place is feeling better than ever. But geez, cleaning's exhausting. Guess I'll have to get five more. Wait, I read that wrong. Oh well. <laughs> I have team games because certain games we play for community nights, like Twitch teams. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense to, to separate those out too. I colored this before and now it's not colored anymore. Is that because of the scary trees? Supper Woods. We've been here before. Have we been to this lower level before? Whoa! It's a little spider! It's meditating? Hello, I love you? Whoa. Well, now it's very bright in here. Okay, bye. Have we... What was that? A present! You got a gnome hat. Uh huh, we got a cone hat. Oh, I can go up here now. Oh, and then this connects through because we've definitely been over there.
<gasps> Trash. Doo -doo -doo. Foxy? Oh, we got little fox ears. How do I get the trash that's up there? Some nice warm tones. We were talking about fall colors earlier. more of these gaps here. Okay, I love it. So bright. Hi, Parker. Welcome in. We're winning. Truly. Um, I hope you're having a good one. We're painting. And painting is always winning. Wait, is there a way to... No. I can't help but feel like we learned a new ability last time and I forgot what it was. Scribble all over this forest. Can we make it down here? Oh, no, it's through here. It seems like there's a path. Right? I don't know. Maybe there was a cat down there and I already got it. This keeps getting uncolored. I feel like it's because of the evil magic. Wait, was that trash? No. And this goes to Gulp Swamp. New decor. Oh, so much decor. Wait, you can't put decor, like, out in the world, can you? You can? Oh no, it's like Animal Crossing. I can decorate my island. They've just added like a hundred hours to the playtime. <laughs> Depending on how much you like that type of thing. <laughs> it's too much, yeah. We I mean, it's funny because there's so much- it seems like there's a lot of furniture, but I don't think there's enough furniture to like- I mean, this map is very large. But you could put little couches and chairs at the waterfront and things like that. Or outside the cafe, you could do some outdoor seating. Decorating your island? Heck yes. Didn't you post a bunch of pictures of the updates, Loki? I love- I love Animal Crossing. It's so good. I live through- I live vicariously through others for Animal Crossing things lately. Um... I don't know where I'm going though. <laughs> Blackberry's house, yum cave, phone booth, 
Lost Kid Daycare. My house, Nibble Tunnel. I think we want to go up here to Nibble Tunnel and Brew Path. Because we couldn't get to Brew Path before. I'm assuming it's blocked by a vine that we can use now. And I want to go back to the Art Academy at some point and draw some more paintings because those show up in the overworld, which is really nice. I just watch. I don't think I have the capacity to build. Yeah. I wanted to do a build, but I didn't have the patience or the time for it. Because the when they get they gave you the dream address thing, when that came out, everyone was like, oh, I gotta finish mine and make a dream address and people can go see it. And I never was able to put something together. Did I just get stuck in the house? Weird. How do we get up there? Through the garden. Yeah. Let's go through here. I'm always blown away with how creative people are. I'm not great at it, but I enjoy that's all that matters. Definitely all that matters is that you're having a good time. I always love seeing how people recreate things from real life in Animal Crossing, and the the use of backdrops and perspective and things like that is really cool. This is Nibble Tunnel. What's over here? Brew Path? Different Nibble Tunnel entrance? What? What? No. Oh god. No, I still don't think we can get over there. How do I launch myself across? I had forgotten that was there. Dinner's this way. No, we have to go this way. We're trying to go to dinners, not potluck. Glow, swim, jump. Okay, yeah, I did learn an ability that I forgot. <laughs> Where did I need that earlier? For that other piece of trash. Well, good job, Jen, for reading the menu. These caves have the brightest colors. Magenta! Purple! Cyan! Marigold? Goldenrod? What would you call that? so bright where does this go whoa a big present you got a brush style thanks Where is this on the map? I don't think we've been to this place yet. Got 
Gotta give it some variety. Okay, beautiful. And paint the present itself, I guess. Can't go that way. Can't go that way. best noises actually you can turn off the squelch noises but I've kind of grown rather fond of them <laughs> is that weird <laughs> and now we're back over here There's like a booming city in this game? Hi Clementine! Seafood! What brings you to the big city? Busy with important wielder stuff? I guess so. Hmm... You should come get a slice with me. I know the perfect place. In terms of screens, it's just one up from here. I'll meet you inside. Cyclists. Oh, lost cat. Doo -doo -doo. Come back so I can paint you. Come to my rooftop party. Just head north from here. Pizza! Hi Clementine! Hey, I cannot wait to, um... Hey seafood! You look... kinda down. Oh, I guess I am. It's about chicory. Oh my gosh, no! Did she say something nasty to you? Do I have to go beat her up? No. I mean, she did. But you shouldn't beat her up. If you say so. <laughs> I guess she must be going through a lot right now, too. Yeah, she is. With everything happening, I hope she's okay. But I wouldn't worry about what she said. You're the sweetest, coolest little wielder there's ever been. And I'm not just saying that because I'm your sister. I love you, seafood. You know I always have your back. Sisterly love. It's a really good hug. Thanks, Clementine. Did you still want to have a slice with me? Uh, yes. Okay, let's go. Pizza. <laughs> uh huh. That hits the spot. It's interesting that they're all named after food, and then we're gonna go eat some food. I think it's fine. What's a what's a human name that's an edible thing? Why am I drawing a blank? I'm surprised I haven't heard of this place before. How's wielding going anyway? It's been kind of a lot, to be honest. Chicory is doing worse than ever. And the Bug Queen needs my help or something. <laughs> and the Elevensies Gallery is missing paintings. Not to mention there's lost kids everywhere. Ha! Huh. You're so focused on everyone else's problems. Oh. Am I? Yeah, you always say yes to everything. But, you know. It's okay to say no sometimes, too. Things are different now that I'm wielding. I can't just let everyone down. Can't you? Coop. Clementine, I don't think you really get it. Even wielders gotta take breaks, you know? You need to make time for yourself, too. But, how am I supposed to do that? 
Hey, um, excuse me. You're the wielder, right? Dude, we're kind of having a moment. <laughs> Rosemary, yeah, that's a good example. I'd be terrified if I lived in a black and white world. And then someone comes along, goes boop, and slowly a single color spreads across everything I see. A little jarring. There's gonna be an armadillo named Pizza somewhere, yeah. Picnic, there you go. Rosemary's a good one. I, there's, I mean, Basil, right? We met a Basil. Um... That it's so hard to be on the spot and have to think of things like that. Oh. Well, so like I was saying, my slice is pretty is pretty dang good, right? But I really don't know a thing about marketing. I need help getting the word out. So I thought, while you're here, could you design a logo for me? Are people just like that with you? Basically. No wonder you're such a little stress ball. Well, why don't you let me help you? I could scribble some stuff, and then you could add as much or as little as you feel like. That'd be fun, right? I like this. Okay, now your turn. Oh, I love it. Uh... Pizza. Oh wait. I want the small one. Hi, Kays. Welcome in. How are you? We're playing Chicory. It's so good. It's basically just a coloring book. Not just a coloring book. Coloring books are important. Alright, our pizza is slightly green. Don't I have a... Circle stamp somewhere? Oh, but it's not filled in. <laughs> Little heart-shaped pepperonis. No, I don't like it. Graphic design! Hi, Matt. Welcome in. Clementine, Hazel, Graham, Jasmine. Good ones, good ones. Thank you, Eric. I could not for the life of me. Have you all seen that video um prompt the tiktok prompt of you roll the dice for a letter and then there's a list of you know celebrity food item body part and you have to come up with them that start with that letter there's a game like that too we used to play as kids it's categories and everybody watches them they're like oh psh, that's easy why can't they think of this and then you try to do it yourself and you're on the spot and you can't think of anything it's a whole nother level when you're not the one in charge, like, being filmed or whatever. Wait, okay, there we go. Pizza pie! And then we want... Like, a green squiggle of a pepper. Yeah. And then we want like a orange peace sign. <laughs> and maybe like a purple peace sign too, just for fun. Only that line is overlapping. There we go. I love it. <laughs> Categories is my jam. That used to be a family gathering favorite. Oh, yes, this is it. The power of your teamwork. It's created the perfect logo. That was fun, but I gotta get going now. Good luck with everything, seafood. And remember, it's okay to say no. Love ya! Alright, I'm gonna paint your pizza pilot parlor. Pizza piler. 
cute. Now it needs some scribbles. What other color? Oh yeah, we have like a dark blue also. Bye! Parlor for pilots, I like it. Hey, macaroons here! Oi! There's nothing like a perfect slice! I'll go anywhere they say is good. I'll go anywhere they say is bad, too. I just really like me some slice. Brussels sprout. I've never heard of this place, but all of a sudden, everyone says it's cool. So I wanted to check it out, but the line is so long and I'm so hungry. Maybe I should have tried something unpopular instead. No, this place is good. I did the logo. Look. <laughs> Hi, Boba. Welcome in. How are you? We're painting. Oh, look at this little guy on the, on the side of this building. Dorito guy. This is where the rooftop party is going to be later, I think. The line is so long. One person. Maybe it's busy now if I go back. Yeah, there's three people in line. Oh yeah, Bigoli is the name of the owner. Mamma mia, look at this lineup. Thanks for saving my humble little shop. But now if you'll excuse me, I've got slice to bake. Stevia? Hey, what what's going on here? <laughs> I've been the only guy going to this shop for years. Now all of a sudden they've got a logo? And a huge lineup? Man, this place changed. Sold their soul to make a buck. Peh. And you're still here. I gotta get some slice, though. <laughs> gotta get that slice. The power of the slice. <laughs> Wait, I wanna... Oh. Okay, there you go. Turnip's here! I love turnip! No, don't sit down. Oh, boy. I had such a trip getting here for potluck. I got lost probably six or seven times. But now I'm finally here. This line is my final challenge. Then I can finally get some tasty, tasty slice. They don't call it pizza. They call it slice. It's a slice shop. Slice of what? The colors in the shop. <laughs> I need New York gin all the time. <laughs> you ever think about how slice is a weird name for something? I know it's because you eat it in slices, but... Well... Never mind. <laughs> bye bye. Hi, Peppermint. Whoa, I didn't know I could fall in love with a company logo. But here we are. You did it again. I never cared that much for Slice, but that's just because I never saw it through your eyes. Seafood, you show me the beauty in everything. <laughs> are there new people? They're switched order. Dude, you dropped your pen. Slice of life. I want a slice. I'm in love with the logo. Oh, I hope there's an- Oh, cyclists. I'm sorry. They actually stopped for you. Bye. Look at this cat. Oh, trash. Oh, sorry. Excuse me. Oh, sorry, excuse me, didn't see you. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna paint the sidewalks. Oh, you can paint like individual sidewalk squares. That's pretty fun. <laughs> see if it is lucky it's not a car town. We're fine. Let's go get some mail. Harumph. Aha! It's you, the new wielder. About time you showed up. We need to talk about this mail. Okay, I'm here. What's up? You're you're gonna be blue now. Sometimes I have trouble getting the brush to lock on to the specific thing that I want to paint. But we manage. 
How are you filling it quickly? Yeah, I have a, um, you're talking about the paint bucket? Or like when I select one of these and it changes the whole object. That just happens automatically. But if I'm filling a whole area, I use the paint bucket brush tool. All right, let's talk to Artichoke. What a fun name. Oh, uh, what's up with the mail? What's up with the mail? It's going nowhere. That's what's up. My workers haven't shown up since the color wipe. Someone needs to deliver it. And that someone is you. Huh? Why me? Because you're a public servant. And you travel around anyway. And it was your color wiping that got us into this mess. But no buts. Now take this. Doo -doo -doo. A mailbag. Doo -doo -doo. A letter to deliver. It's addressed to two screens right from dinner's transit bench. You can check it anytime in your collection screen. Come back after it's delivered. Come on now, don't go deliver that letter. Yeah, whatever. Can I go through the door back there? I don't think so. I didn't know there was a paint bucket? Yeah, I don't know. Um, if that's something they added in later, that's a good question. <gasps> Skunk friend, Pepper. Oh, a letter for me? Let me see. Heh, <laughs> yes, oh thank goodness, yes. Somebody named Beans has my lost son. I was deathly worried, I'm so glad he's safe. All the way in luncheon. How did he wander off so far? Poor thing. I've gotta head to luncheon right away. But thank you so much. I hope you'll see you again sometime. Your mailbag is empty. Go talk to postmas post person, whatever it said. Oh, that does okay, yeah. Uh it's helpful to fill the screens, too, because when you come back later and you want to get around fast, you can swim through the paint and it's a little bit quicker. Is the music too loud? This city is loud. Oh, hey, I know that guy. What are you doing up there? Excuse me. Dinner's this way. Grub caverns this way. That's where we need to go eventually. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. This is what I wanted. Whatever. The music is a bop, yeah. My workers haven't shown up since the wipe rather than going to find them since they might be in trouble or something. Just do their job. Sound logic. Seems reasonable. Although I wasn't really done in the city yet. Trash. Oh, that's not trash, that's just plants. Hey, what are you doing back here, Stevia? Hey, the name's Stevia. You probably saw me and thought, what a tough looking guy with smarts about the streets. And will you be 100% right? I've got my graffiti tag and everything. The one with the teeth. Right there on the ground. Besides here, I've got it on four buildings and dinners. So, hey, do me a favor. <laughs> color in all my graffiti tags. That'll make them pop. If you do, I'll give you something nice. Heh, I'm kind of a wild guy. I do what I want. <laughs> and I don't care what people think. You dig? So yeah, go color in my tags on buildings and dinners. Looks like you've got two left. There's only two? <laughs> Alright. The teeth. We gotta find the teeth. People are whistling at me. Dang, he's cool. What a tough guy. This guy is smart about the streets. Oh, this is a busy road. Oh, I'm nervous. Oh, teeth.
This is a very big building. Rooftop party, come upstairs. Oh, this is the... Oh, hi! Hi, avocado! Welcome to the rooftop party! Did you see my flyers? I did. To be honest, I'm kind of new to throwing parties. People keep coming up here, but... When they see the big empty roof, they just kind of look around awkwardly. Oh, and then they, uh, leave. I probably should have thought about decoration or furni fr fr furniture. We've got furniture. Lesson learned. Uh, if you have any of that stuff, you should totally throw it down here. I've always wanted to throw a party, so when I moved into this place and saw that it had this rad rooftop, my party throwing senses went into overdrive. <sighs> Next time decoration, then flyers. I feel really silly about all this. This party obviously needs decorations, but now the flies are all up and people are coming, so I can't leave. If you have any furniture, please help. Okay, fine. Because I like you. Cool. Words are hard. I can't give you a rug? No, I can. It just wasn't selected. Antique rug. I rug? Okay, this is for when people come in. Sound? Oh, I don't have it. I don't have that. Like a little chair up here. How do I scroll down? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Some of these menus I don't understand how to use. Hi Jeffrey, welcome in. I feel like I missed a bunch here in a whole new area. We, um, I forget what chapter we're on. We, we were cruising last time. Today I've been taking a lot more time to chill and talk to NPCs. But I want to use those lamps at my house. I could put a bed on the rooftop. What's this? Oh, sound system. And a grandfather clock. Why can I not scroll down? This is weird. I made sure to catch up on the last VOD because I've been enjoying the playthrough. Thanks, Jeffrey. I'm glad you're liking it. I love this game. The VODs are probably um, pretty easy to get through too because it's it's a little bit shorter, very lighthearted. I'm greedy and I want to use these in my own room. Also, what do you need a lamp when you're for when you're outside? Here, we'll put this like beanbag chair in the corner. All right, what do you think? I guess I better come clean. I'm I'm not even experienced at partying. I'm sorry, I know you. it must be shocking. I've always heard how they're so cool. You know, like when people say, it's party time. I wanted that to be me, at least once. The party's coming together a bit. Still feels a bit empty. You gotta have more chairs and things. Ooh, so we're doing it now, right? We're chatting here, this is partying, right? Wow, 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 this is so cool. I, I love to party. <laughs> This is looking like a good start for the party. We'll probably need more stuff, though. Okay, this is repeating. I gave you lots of stuff. Let's see if there's people. Not yet. Maybe I need to color it in. Pistachio. Oh, hi. I love it here. I was just out for a wander. But I had to stop and rest when I saw this pretty spot. You colored it, right? You did great. Thanks so much. Oh, and by the way, I want to pass along a friendly tip. If you place seats from your decor anywhere in the world, wanderers like me will probably show up there. Could be a neat way to make some friends, you know? See you around. Okay, that's fun.
for when the party goes into the night. But there's like street lamps, right? I don't know. I guess I should put a lamp, huh? Ooh, I hear a lost kid. Which one of you was it? It's this, right? There you are. Doo -doo -doo. Human beings, it turns out, are weird. Are weird. Hi, Trav. Welcome back to the human race. Thanks for the resub. Enjoy your Earth Badger emotes, your ad previewing. We're so glad to have you. Thank you for 16 months. Happy Friday. I hope you're doing well. We're just coloring. Oh, this looks like a bicycle shop. And now everybody's pink. I like your trench coat. An adult? <laughs> yeah, okay, I believe you. <clears throat> Hello, fellow adult. I'm in line to get my transit pass to go on cool adult adventures. Um, which aren't even that cool because I go on them all the time. As, as an adult. <laughs> Taxes, accounting, mowing lawns, vegetables. These are my favorite things. <laughs> have you seen the latest adult-rated film? <laughs> I sure have. I've seen them all. Even the ones with lots of... K -k kissing Ew. <laughs> oh, I'm having a great day, Trav. This game rules. All right, let's talk to Plum. Good day to you. This is the Transit Pass Agency. If you're a citizen of age, you're entitled to a free transit pass here. Would you like a transit pass? Yeah. Are you gonna take my picture? Oh, you can change your name. I'm keeping seafood. Okay, seafood. What's your birth month? Whoa. Is it gonna ask for my birthday? Do you all you already know my birthday? And what day of the month for your birthday? It's in groups. Oh, I see. If I click this, it'll yeah yeah yeah. It'll like spread everything out. That's me. Okay, thank you. We made chicory of Capricorn. <laughs> I have that conversation at work like twice a week. Have you seen the latest adult rated film? <laughs> have you done any taxes today? <laughs> now come stand in front of the camera. Take my picture. I'm gonna take your photo. Please maintain a neutral expression and pose. Okay. Now just sign on the bottom here. Please refrain from marking other areas. Yeah, okay. <laughs> We're so cute. We're the wielder. We gotta mark other areas. And you can change the background. We could put a little peace sign. In a cute teal color or like a purple. I like this color. <laughs> Alright, I'll sign it. Let's sign it in blue. I like this blue. I don't know how to spell. This is my signature now. Seafood. <laughs> Not the small talk. <laughs> I 
I like this kind of orangey red too. This is the coolest transit pass I've ever seen. Okay, coloring in the wing thing does not work. Um, which one is the heart? Aww. All done. Ta-da! Your new card is ready. You can view it anytime on collection screen. You can also travel between official transit. Oh, that's okay. We've seen the transit benches and they have the little wing. Now I understand. Take a seat near any transit sign and flash your card. Have a nice day. Thank you. Are you going to help this adult over there in the corner? Oh, you have a transit pass? Can we, um... Can I have it? <laughs> okay, my concern is not that it's illegal, it's that I want to use it. I haven't even used it yet. Um, um, so can I have your transit pass? I'm not sure. Maybe some other time after I get to try it out. Yeah, the benches! It's Hollow Knight! Oh, thanks, Soul. <laughs> Whoa, it's a crow on a unicycle. Coffee the crow, omelet the horse. Why are you reading that? Huh? I'm waiting for transit. Sure, but why are you reading that? It's not that bad. It's interesting political theory. Have you read it? I have. It's garbage. What's wrong with new ideas? Nothing at all. You can't just dismiss it. It addresses actual issues. Like, there's plenty that works right now, don't get me wrong. Shared worker profit is functional, government controlled property, all that. But it sucks if you want to start your own business. <laughs> Fairness is great, but all that red tape prevents innovation. Sure, I agree. So shouldn't we do something to improve it? I think we should abolish money altogether. <laughs> Don't tell me you're one of those. How do you imagine society functioning without money? You gonna barter for every slice you order? No. You create a shared storehouse of all goods and products. Everyone contributes to the storehouse to the extent of their ability and takes to the extent of their need. Wow, sounds real simple. It is. What if someone decides to steal it all for themselves? Then they pit themselves against all of society. They wouldn't win. What if someone burns down the storehouse? You wouldn't actually keep it all in just one place. We can deflect and theorize all day. I'm just saying it would work. There's a lot of things to figure out, but all systems of government have things to figure out. <laughs> this is in this game! <laughs> what does this say about student loans? I don't know, let's see. I'm not convinced. Because you're believing garbage. No, because it doesn't make sense. Where's the motivation? Why would anyone do anything? The existence of money doesn't fix existentialism either. But in a moneyless society, you're free to explore that on your own terms, without the demand for profit keep you, keeping you on a treadmill. Society would never just transform like that. Money solves too many problems too well. I'm telling you, this theory is sound. The issue is that workers have way too much power right now. Like seriously, why should all workers share profit equally? People who actually start businesses should profit from their good ideas. Then you have an economy driven by people's innovation. Capitalism. That's seriously the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. A successful business would consolidate its wealth to just a few people. So you'd end up with a tiny ruling class exploiting everyone's labor. And only lucky rich people would actually be free to have ideas. The rest of us wouldn't be stuck working for them. Well, it's just a theory. <laughs> okay, so this game exists in a non-capitalist society. That was a fun little tidbit. <laughs> Oh, it's too much for noon on a Friday. No, I'm glad they included that. Um, I'm trying to do this. There we go. And do some red sidewalks here. Yeah. Come here. 
I need to paint you. Yeah, they just straight up put a combo between a capitalist and a communist in a game. A moneyless society, shared wealth of workers, r rich ruling class. It's all in Chicory, a colorful tale. Chicory, a socialist tale. <laughs> <laughs> this crow on a unicycle is making me feel some type of way. <laughs> That's Coffee the Crow. Oh, there's the last um, tag of that one guy. Wait, I can get back here. What's back here? Oh, just the trash. buttons there we go oh this is like a layer cake building oh I thought each layer was gonna be a different color oh well oh this is a gardening shop cute oh, there is an armadillo or is it a pangolin croquette hello this is the plant exchange we'll take litter and trash and give you plants it's a new program we initiated to clean up Picnic. So if you spot any litter lying around, pick it up. And if you have trash, don't leave it on the ground. The bigger the plant, the more litter we take in exchange. The gro growing plants on the far right might seem a bit small, but if you plant them and leave them for a while, they'll get huge. Litter can show up in all kinds of places, unfortunately. It tends to be more gray or darker colored than other things, so keep an eye out for things like that. We've got so much trash to trade in. Take any plant you like. Potted plant, big plant, small plant, growing plant. Oh my gosh, I want them all. Doo -doo -doo. Cotton grass. Oh, and they change out. You got lupin. Oh, this is amazing. Smileys! Oh. Seedling! I love this game. What the game is saying is money is trash. It's a moneyless society, but if you have lots of trash, you can get plants. But it's interesting, I can't- you- I- I- I don't have a yard. I can take the potted plants and put them in my house. But I can, um, put these all over picnic. Hooked for life, yes, yeah, so- <laughs> Plant parents unite. It's not really letting me paint your floor, huh? How many plants you got, Croquette? Should we just keep going? I don't know if there's other things we can use our trash for, but we got one of each for now. Oh, trash. I got distracted by the gardening store. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Oh well. Adam, welcome back. How's your food? We're painting the city. I really like this area. This takes us back to the tunnel, right? Yeah. <laughs> More playing games are on the horizon, yes. Oh, we haven't been here yet.
Can I get this sign? Yep. Can I get you? Yep. Okay, I like it. This is going well. Fennel! Man, dinner just ain't the same anymore. The color wipe really killed the vibe. This wall, for instance, it used to have a beautiful mural. I'd see it every day and it inspired me to live a beautiful life. Without it, there's nothing to inspire me. Guess my life just sucks now. Oh, are you finished painting this wall? No, not yet. Oh, okay. Can't wait! Uh, what should we paint? We met the adult, yes. <laughs> and I decided not to give them my transit pass yet. This, uh, this is, this wavy line is kind of messing with me here. I wanted to make a flower. Oh, I have a flower stamp. How do I... Here we go. Yeah, there are some things about the menu that I really don't like, but otherwise, incredible game. I feel like I should have made the background that beige color. Wow, looking at this, it actually doesn't make me feel better after all. How am I supposed to improve my life? <laughs> Thanks for the trash. That's something to encapsulate how I feel. I'll be on the lookout for other external sources of joy. <laughs> trash. Oh, I think there's a cat up here in one of these. No, you're moving from tree to tree. Oh man, do you know Chicory? That's so wicked. I'm a big, big fan. Her colors made the world feel so alive and magical. You could feel her spirit bursting out of every stroke. She must be so cool in person. I saw Chicory once, when she was wielder, filling in dinners. I really wanted to say something, but I was so nervous, haha. <laughs> and she looked so busy, I just kept walking. I still think about it sometimes, though. Like, what if we became friends, then? I'm not like an artist or anything. I'm a pretty decent DJ, though. Do lots of parties and club- You gotta go DJ that party! The rooftop party! Maybe Chicory isn't really the club type. Guess we just live in different worlds. Cute. Why do I identify with all these characters? Yeah. <laughs> okay, we've been up here. This is the slice shop. Oh, they're looking at my mural. This is a really good mural. I feel like it shows a different side of you than we've seen before. It's cool that you're so talented, but you're still evolving and trying new things. Nobody appreciates you enough. Yeah, I love seeing this outsider art. You've adorned this wall with your creativity, and in doing so, snatch some power straight from the establishment. Although I guess the whole wielder thing enforces an ancient hierarchy, with gatekeeping rules and power dynamics, which basically makes you the establishment of art. So I guess... Nothing actually transgressive happened here. Just more of the establishment. Exerting its dominance over us common artists. Man, I hate that. <laughs> As an art student, I'm trying to keep up with my wielder's work. It's cool to see you take your skills to the streets. Is, is that... Did I say that right? Please, Brussels Sprout. Well, I like it anyways. Okay, dude. That's it for dialogue. 
Oh, hi! Egg! Thanks for painting this place. Seeing the blank white kind of bothers me. But here it's really beautiful. You're making our world a better place. I hope you keep filling it in. I'm trying to do better. I wasn't filling in very much stuff in the beginning. The paint bucket really helps. Oh, I forget that I can jump. Oh, nice. All my graffiti tags are looking colorful and beautiful. Thanks for that. Take this. Oh, it's not trash. It's like an airbrush brush style. I'm good for now. I nicked that off of some dorky art student. You stole it? Oh, I'm kidding. It's a legitimate purchase and not stolen property. Just thought it would sound cool. <laughs> Have fun with it. Stealing isn't cool, dude. People are always asking me, Stevia, how are you such a cool and tough guy? The trick is, you gotta stop caring about anything. Don't get attached to nothing or no one. Then nothing can hurt you. I don't play by the rules. Yeah, watch out, buddy. We live in a society. <laughs> oh, this is a fun game. We do, in fact, live in a society. Suddenly, he's kind of sad. Yeah, I, um... Great advice, I'll take it. No, Eric, that was not what we were supposed to take away from that. Att forming attachments and friendships is good. <laughs> uh... Oh, there's a cat. Meow. Do -do -do. Oh, I meant to do this. Whose house is this? Cool guy didn't say that, and he does graffiti, so that means authority. <laughs> Attachments lead to the dark side. Uh-oh. This is true. I guess. Hey, I have this chair. I put it at the rooftop party. Spinach! A litter-free province. That's my dream for picnic. Wouldn't that be lovely? But for it to come true, we've got to pick it all up. I'm trying to do my part, but there's just so much. Gotta head back to work. Hope everyone has a good time zone. Good luck with work. See you, Trav. Happy time zone. Right now, the place you've been with the most litter would be dinners. There's only... There's litter on two screens there. It'd be so beautiful if not for the litter. <laughs> you make fun noises. I like your cute little house. Spinach. <laughs> Oh, foggy. I don't think I can get through here yet. Let's check out what colors. Gray, blue gray, uh, green gray, and orange gray. Huh. Neat. Dinners, grub caverns. What else were we gonna do in the city? Oh, there's litter that I didn't pick up, but I think one of them is up on this roof. Yeah, right there. I don't know how to get that one yet. So, did you deliver the letter? Yeah, it was to someone like right outside. Are you sure you need me to deliver these for you? Absolutely, yes. 
this time I've got a whole stack for you to deliver. <laughs> a bunch of letters. The first one is addressed to the middle of three square houses in a row. If you want to deliver a different one, sort it on your collection screen. Trouble figuring out? Oh. If only there were some kind of standard way to address letters. <laughs> but there isn't! <laughs> Go figure it out yourself. Fine. Did we go in here? <gasps> Salon! I want to paint this. There we go. Uh, you and then you and you and then you're gonna have a pink shirt. Mochi, want to get a haircut? Yeah. How long do you want? Ooh, surprise me. Do you want a cut that's more cool or cute? I want to be cool like, uh, Stevia. <laughs> Addresses are just a facet of capitalist society, man. Should it be more pretty or tough? Surprise me. Ta-da! What do you think? Doesn't it look the same? <laughs> oh, I think our hair like sticks up on top a little tuft before and now we have some cool bangs. Whoa! Shaved sides! These are all so cool. I want to change my answers to anything for all of them. Ooh, it's a ponytail! I like it. It'll be there under your headwear. That's the best I can do. I hope you like it. I used to have a partner here. Who did some really crazy stuff with hair? We started the shop together. Ain't seen them in a long, long time, though. Tried to write them once. But I don't think the letter ever made it. Hope they're doing okay out there. I don't know where that came from. Have a nice day. Look, Mochi has tattoos. I don't like that our ponytail looks so similar to our... Um our brush or is that our brush do we just have this cool like pompadour is that what is that what's happening here I thought it was a pony I think it was just the brush the whole time oh look with the headband oh I love it thank you mochi I'm gonna deliver your letter I want to see what it's like to go ride transit, and then maybe we'll try giving our transit pass to that adult. Oh, it's just bench warp. That's cool. Let's go to luncheon and check on the, um, the lost kids. <laughs> oh, hi! Thank you! It's like a fun little falcon. Okay, we didn't get enough kids yet to, um, get more furniture. Let's do purple instead. <laughs> there's so many cats and there's a skunk in here. <laughs> You're not a cat! Oh, Pepper's here! My son was here after all. I'm so glad Beans took care of him for me. 
But there's a huge problem. Not only did my son go missing and Bean's kids too, but there's tons of lost cases reported across Picnic. I can't sit idly while this goes on. So I cross-reference every report I could find and put together, well, this. Doo -doo -doo. Oh, a kid tracker. Mistake, hi. Here to say hi and lurk. Thanks for the lurk. This game is so cute. It's got almost Donut County humor at times, too. Like, it's very funny. It's very lighthearted, but also with kind of a heavy at times um, mental health message. I can't say enough good things about it. That bird's a rock. <laughs> uh, what it- not a rock. That's like rock's feather from... Link's Awakening. Roke? I don't know how to say it, but I know that's a thing. Anyway, we got a kid tracker. It's an add-on to your camera map. It'll show you where all the kids remain- the remaining lost kids are. Pretty cool, hey? While you track them down, I'll take care of them here with beans. Let's get everyone home safe together. Oh, I want to paint your little bandana blue. It's not letting me. Everything else is changing color except for your bandana. Okay, well. Stinky. Like rock. Oh, okay. Well. Now I know. Do we think we should give our transit pass away? I wonder if we try to and it doesn't let you. That's a really nice feature. To have fast travel. Wait, wasn't- is this the transit place? Um, so can I have your transit pass? Okay. A bunch of kids and they just run away you got a stash I'm an adult can I have another one did, did you illegally give your transit pass to those children not my problem would you like a transit pass <laughs> seafood I gotta make another one <laughs> now come stand in front of the camera I liked my old one. Okay, now sign the bottom. Please refrain from marking other areas. Aw, oh, man. We signed it seafood. C. Food. C feud. What else did I do to it? I gave it little embellishments everywhere. We'll make it a little more squiggly. I legally gave my transit pass to an adult. <laughs> Why is my cursor moving so slow all of a sudden? Now I have this cool headband in my picture, though. Let's do some flowers. Ooh, that is not a pleasant noise. That was better. Let's do a heart. I want it to be pink. And a peace sign, and we'll make that teal. Okay. Doo -doo -doo. Thanks. I wonder where those kids went. 
Maybe we'll run into them again. Oh, I forgot about the poses. Yeah, that's a thing. Oh, wow, this is kind of embarrassing. I came out here to study your work. I didn't think I'd run into you here. Um, um, I'm not sure what to say. It's really nice. Thanks for uh, coloring everything. Don't sweat it. Alright. Let's do some plot. <laughs> this city is way too much fun. I don't know about any kids, but the adult probably went to do some taxes and got it. Uh, go to an R-rated movie with lots of kissing. Probably. Just adult things. You all know how it is, fellow adults. Alright, let's go. Blue? Neons! Ooh, I like this palette. Bloop! <laughs> oh, we did use the jump last time. We used it to get a present, and then I forgot we had it. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. Trash. Doo -doo -doo. There's just so much. Why is there so much litter in this cave? I remember these bugs. Okay. How do we do this? You got a bell. I like I really like my headband right now. all this vine stuff. Does this block my path? Oh no, I can just walk over it. Descent to feast. What's over here? New colors? Right? Or are these the same? I don't know. I think they're the same, actually. I know, I don't want to cover up my cool hairdo. Mochi did such a nice job. Wait, can we jump down from above this screen? What did that sign say? Bugs only? violet color remains one of those watercolor coloring books I have as a oh reminds me the pastel violet they what I'm thinking of coloring books that I think you just use plain water and then they showed up as a color I think I had one of those and that kind of reminds me of, of it too and it was like dots like this yeah 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 okay we're thinking the same thing very cool. 
How do I get up there? Oh, like this. Wait, wait, wait. Also, high streams. Uh, I need to color this ledge. Nice. Do, 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 do. Spikes? Oh. <laughs> okay. I'm into it. <laughs> Oh, and then that's the foggy area, so I don't think we can get to the rest of that part of the forest. Why does the stream always shoot me back to my childhood? I don't know why it always comes up. Some lost memory of some toy that we had as a kid. Just nostalgic, yeah. Seafood is entering goth phase. Wait, let's put on a matching shirt. Oh. Bandana doesn't work with spikes, but you can wear the black t-shirt with jeans. Scarf doesn't work. Wait, is this spike and spike? Oh, I didn't know we had a spike shirt. Stripes, stars, big star, black dress, black tee, college. I kind of like the spike shirt and shades of some kind. Oh, we could put our headband back on. Big shades. Clown! There's the adult stash. Let's just do this for now. Cool. The black dress was punk. A portal for lost memories. Black dress spike color? Okay. I want- I wish you could do the spike color and the shades though. I'm gonna do this for now. And then when we go back into the city for the rooftop party, we'll put on our nice dress. Although we might not be back for a little bit because we're gonna go do this grub mission. You can't, um... Yeah, I'm curious about that other screen. Huh. What does this say? Bugs only. Shortcut to surface. Oh. Okay, so we can't do that. I thought maybe we could. Let's go to feast. Grub deep? This is funky looking. Very echoey noises. Ah, oh, watch out! Phew. You almost stepped on me. I'm Prunus, the royal bug ambassador. I've been waiting to take you to the queen. Queen Drosera, ruler of all insects. She's, well, she's not accustomed to outsiders. But this matter is serious, so you'll need to meet her. Our city is deep, deep down in the heart of these caverns. The path might be tough for a non-bug. Are we gonna minish cap? Are they gonna shrink me down? Well, I'll see you down there. Did you move? Can I... Am I gonna step on you? You're so tiny. Wait, can I climb this little vine thing here? No. I don't like that. Oh, you're eating the colors! You made me not pink anymore. Huh. 
Huh. Come over here. I got you a snack. That's so cute! I like it. I didn't like it before, but now I do. Goth? Okay, well, we didn't have a goth outfit before, but now we have gothy. And Spike. <laughs> it was worth waiting. <laughs> Let's go. I've got a skull tee and a spike necklace. Oh, goodness. Can you go over here, please? Nice shirt. No, no, no. That's not goth. Now where to? Can you go to the next screen? Oh, I can go up here. What? Why didn't you? Stay there. Fun. Okay, they're gone, so I can paint this room now. Oh, I'm sorry! It must be hard for you to see in this dark. Well, good news, the city's just ahead. I hope I didn't scare you too much about Queen Drosera. She is a massive ancient beast of the darkness. But also a total sweetheart. I'm sure you'll be fine. Come along now. Okay, yeah, appropriate to be wearing our goth outfit to meet a queen of darkness. Let's go. Can I jump down here? I kind of want to make us pink and purple. Yeah. I love it. Oh, drat. The weight of the city is just down from here, but the rocks have fallen in the way. What an inconvenience. Well, not for me. I can crawl around them easily. But life's hard for a non-bug, isn't it? As an ambassador, I've learned a lot about cultural sensitivity. I suppose you'll need to find a way through. Don't worry, I'll wait patiently for you. Oh. Oh, this is fun. Alright, uh... Come back up here. And now you're gonna be going all over the place. No, you just do little areas at a time. Okay. Oh, but I gotta transport this using your platform. music. I'm quite enjoying. What? Where are you going? <laughs> yeah, I know there's lots of tasty snacks over here. You gotta follow the path I made, though. Oh. This is very difficult. Okay. Now I can get through. Hi, Julia. Welcome in. How are you? It's good to see you. Does your outfit change the colors you use? No. Um, 
you can only use the colors of the current area that you're in to paint your outfit and then if you keep it this way you can like carry these colors to other areas but when you're in another part of the map you your paintbrush changes yeah exactly happy friday i'm glad you're doing good we're loving this game oh if i go get this present i'm gonna have to backtrack oh wait this isn't Never mind. I thought that was above where we are, but it's below. I'm gonna have to backtrack anyway, because we need to take the paint bubble that we find and bring it back into the final screen. Do we need to bring another one over here? Can we? Yeah. Okay. Uh, wait. Oops, I ran you into a wall. Sorry! Oh no, you can't take them onto a new screen. Well, then... Interesting. Hello. You're in my way a little bit. But it's okay. Because you're wonderful. There we go. I need to get up here. But I don't think I have access to that other... Will you chill on this ledge for me? No? Why don't you like this ledge? Why don't you like this ledge? I think it's like outside of your whatever. Okay. No, stay there! I think this is too far for me to jump anyway. Oh, okay. What's this way? Yeah, it takes the pain out of the vine. They're smart little bugs. They're kind of big bugs, actually. Oh. Yo, can I transport you? No, just me. Okay, well, that wasn't first helpful per se. What? Um, I'm not sure how to get this to work. No, you trapped me! You gotta move, buddy! Aww. I'm assuming it has ledges it magnets to. Yeah, I think... I think maybe that's the case. Aha! Now what do I do with this? It doesn't like that. Is that where you stay? Is that gonna help me get to the right place? That looks right. No! Oh, 
Oh, come on. I don't like this one. This is very finicky. You need to come sit right on the ledge, right there. Yes, thank you. I appreciate you. Okay, so you ended up landing kind of down here. How are you supposed to know? Oh god, I thought I missed it. Doo, 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 doo. A brush style! This style makes straight lines and angles. Let's replace the... oops. The flower. Um, it's not really working. Oh, it's a ruler. Oh, okay, cool. I see. It's not a stamp, it makes the line you're drawing a straight line. Okay, okay, okay. Um, I don't know if I can get to that other screen. Maybe. Ah! Don't attack me! Why won't it let me over there? Oh well. Let's go. jumping. Seafood is astounding purple. Yeah, we're all purple here. <laughs> is the ruler supposed to help us draw lines that these creatures can follow a little bit better? I think that might be part of it. Finish Elements arc. I'm nearly done with season nine. Yes. Oh, we got a fungus hat. Fungus hats are goth. It's so good. Elements is so good. Oh, I love Adventure Time. Excuse me. Oh, I'm trying to get to this vine. Islands was heavy, Elements was a little more silly, was nice. Elements is a little heavy, but I feel like not in its... Con like, the conclusion is really fun. The person who ends up being the hero is excellent. Otterly, welcome in. No, you're good, please. Don't, no need to apologize. We're glad to have you. Real life is, uh, is always gonna take priority and people got stuff going on. Happy Friday. Happy weekend.
You can get them to push these for you? Oh, this changes things. Okay, well, I kind of messed up. I wonder if you can... You can use the paint bucket in reverse to erase stuff. But I think I might have made a mistake. And gotten the... Okay, there we go. Nope, now don't disturb that snowball. Come over here. Come over here, please. Okay, love that, love that. Now this way a little more. Now this way, oops. <laughs> Oh, okay. There we go. <laughs> Not graceful, but I'll take it. Been sick for the last few months. I'm so sorry. Yeah, that definitely makes it hard. There's story arcs. I was passively listening the other day. It sounds like I might need to actually sit down and watch Adventure Time. Yeah, there's arcs. Um, the end, they did three specific arcs. There's a series, a mini-series called Stakes, a mini-series called Islands, and a mini-series called Elements. Um, but if you watch, I mean, it's a lot of adventure time to get through to put the arcs together, because a lot of it is, like, very... In this one episode in season one, and then these two episodes in season four, and then all of a sudden they do a big chunk in seven. They're all spread out. Mono, oh no, Mono is rough. Yeah, no kissing. <laughs> That's a tough one. I had mono in college. Just a lot of resting. My throat hurt really bad when I got it, and um, I had to not work out, which I was racing. That was back when I was doing a lot of cycling, and they were like, oh, well, you're probably not going to be able to race this year. So that was a huge bummer. Yeah, Distant, Distant Lands was really, really good, too. That's, um... Some of it is... It's, like, after the series. It's, like, not super connected with the main story. Wait, how do I... Okay, I realize what I have to do. This game seems calming. It's like a big coloring book. It is a little bit tricky, but not too bad. There's a built-in hint system and you can skip bosses, which is really nice, but the puzzles like this room, you can't really get around. Oops, I need you back up here. Um, I would say my only criticism is that the controls are a little bit wobbly at times. Like, I don't always know. what buttons I'm supposed to be pressing. Can I, like, rearrange this snowball situation here? Okay, there we go. Oh, it knocked me off the ledge! having extreme fatigue yeah oh that's tough got denied medical leave because of bureaucratic reason they got for generous well off friends oh my gosh it's very stressful oh it about it okay that was um that was tough it exploded me pow Anything else that we missed? Yeah, how do I get to that rock? This area is confusing. Can you come up here? To this other screen? 
No? <laughs> I think I need to get to this middle one. Do you still have HBO subscription? I do not, no. I got one to watch Distant Lands, and then when it was over, I discontinued it. I have, and I have Paramount Plus now because of Star Trek. I had to trade out. Alright, I'm I wanna jump down to get this. Spike helmet? Oh cool. <laughs> We're so pretty. I have no Paramount Plus recommends. You had some HBO recommends though. I loved having HBO Max because of all the Ghibli movies, but sadly, I can't, um, I mean, I've seen them all, so it's like, do I have something that I can re-watch stuff on or watch new stuff on? I'm not sure how this screen works. Do I just jump down? This is where we came from, right? With the tra- uh, the gift? I need a skateboard, yeah. Have a question about game mechanics? Sure. Go ahead, Magus. I see, okay. Does using the lock colors function on the dressing room screen keep you from changing color when paint explodes on your face? Oh, yeah, I think so. Duncan's here. <laughs> That's good, I didn't, I think I had seen that and I wasn't really sure what to do with it. I think when I first saw it really early on, I was like, no, I wanna be able to paint myself in this menu, but now it makes sense when we've changed areas so many times. Duncan, come here. Come say hi. Oh. He's so wiggly. Hi, buddy. Let's paint. The escalation, I know, and he's so big, um, he's harder to, if I had to pill him, you know, like, stick the pill in the back of his mouth and then make him swallow it, which is not fun, but sometimes you just gotta do it. Oh, I know what I did wrong there. For your, for your pet's health, you know, you gotta learn how to pill him if that's what they need. But, uh, I don't know if I could do it for him. He's too big. Okay, I hope I don't mess this up again. I gotta not accidentally paint the snowball. Okay, now I gotta go get another one? Yeah. <coughs> I had water right before uh, turning the webcam back on and it went down the wrong way. The king shall not be fooled, but he can be bribed with incrementally larger treats. 
See, and I, bra I broke out the chicken treats, but I shouldn't use them with the pill. I should use them as a reward for eating the pill because he gets the chicken treat. He's like, well, this is great. I just want this. I don't want anything else. <laughs> Made a smoothie, yum. What kind of smoothie? I should do that. This tiny path. Amazing. We are but a tiny bug in a puddle. Boom. Do anything else in here? I don't think so. Mango, pineapple, veggies, water, vanilla, milkshake, protein powder. That's like what I'm gonna make too. Mango, I have frozen mango, coconut yogurt, vanilla protein powder. I could put some strawberries in there too if I want. Okay. We did good. We made it through. To feast. Still not done yet. We finally made it. Well done. It's just a bit further now. I can't wait. So pretty. Got everything set up with the new phone. Good, I'm glad. Oh, what a hassle. Oh, is this the throne? <gasps> Look at this little bug. Y'all are cute. I don't wanna, I don't wanna step on anybody. Oh my gosh, look at this one. little bench. Oh, I like that this is a... It has tears. Wow, pretty. So beautiful. Can I talk to these bugs? No? New colors! Ooh! Ooh, I like these. <gasps> this is it. The entrance to feast. You'll be the first wielder to visit in decades. What a huge, exciting moment. I hope this isn't rude, but you don't look very excited. You seem a bit sad. Oh. Well, I guess I am. Oh. Sorry, I've just been thinking about a fight I had with a friend. Oh, I see. Um, to be honest, I'm starting to feel like I shouldn't even be the wielder. Oh. Chicory is an amazingly talented artist. And I'm nobody. I don't think I belong here. Yes, you do, seafood! Well, I understand how you feel. You do? It's really tough being the royal bug ambassador. I've learned so much about non-bug cultures. Just speaking your language is really tough for a bug like me. You barely have an accent. <laughs> Thank you. All my life, my skills have been totally useless. But actually, they make me different from everyone. So I don't feel like I belong here either. You're the first non-bug I've ever met. 
Oh, wow. Sorry, I must be disappointing. No. No, no, you're lovely. I think you're doing a good job. You came when we needed you. That's what really matters. Um, and for once, I don't feel useless. So thank you very much. Anyway, let's go meet Queen Drosera. Aww. Imposter syndrome is really hitting the protagonist, yeah. And chicory too. I didn't expect eight years to have a, such a big impact on the camera. Oh yeah, new cameras are so good. All right, let's go. Feast. I like your city. You have good colors. Oh. <laughs> There's so many tiny bugs everywhere. Very cool. Cool music. Oh, they speak the same language as that spider we saw. Thank you. You don't like the color? <laughs> okay. Wait, can I exhaust your dialogue even though I don't know what you're saying? Whoa! Bugs! It's Hollow Knight in brighter colors. I cannot understand you. Okay. Where is our ambassador to translate for us? Oop, trash. This palette feels like fruit salad. Yeah. I can dig it. Oops, I keep doing- I keep doing this wrong. Oh, because these aren't- okay. These aren't, like, separate from the background here. Did you ever see a pink praying mantis? Hollow bright, yes! Okay. Well. Oh. Oh, look! Stag beetle! This is Queen Drosera's lair. I've spoken to the guard so you can enter. Uh, just one thing. You can't speak bug, can you? N no That's okay. Give me just a moment. Ah, <laughs> that tickles. Yes, I'm here on your head now. I'll help you to understand Queen Drosera's wretched utterances. <laughs> well, go on then. Oh, this is so beautiful. There we go. I was trying to change these. Can I talk to you? Nope. I want my speech to be described as wretched utterances. Yeah, heck yeah. What a cool little city. Wait, if you're riding on my head now, how come you aren't translating for these other bugs? Seems kind of rude.
Does this go all the way around? Yeah. Just visiting all the places where I can't uh, do anything yet. You're cool. Look at all these bugs. Do you think they have a bench here? Oh, I can't pass that way. Okay. For um, public transit? <laughs> do you see these parts of the wall where there's no solid line to transition between the two are we gonna gain the ability to climb up walls look at this one doesn't have it this one doesn't have it and go on these hatched and dotted patterns do you think game is a metroidvania just like any other game all right I guess we're going in this creepy dark cave hi Queen Drosera can we be friends is that cool with you? Ooh, you're orange now. It's okay. Is it okay? Surface dweller. How dare you enter our chamber? Wait, I want to paint you. Looking so darn cute. Oh, we can't stand it. We swear each wielder gets cuter than the last. You see, I warned you. She's so embarrassing. Oh, hush, Prunus. So you'll help us, won't you? We don't know why or where they've come from, but we're besieged by black roots from above. They're cramping poor us in our hole here. And they're scaring our citizens, too. Our pact with the wielders means you owe us assistance. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Hmm, you don't speak bug, we suppose. That may be tricky. Prunus, would you be a deer and live on this one's head? Uh, of course, it would be my pleasure. Uh, won't that be awkward? Oh, no, no, no. It's a dream come true. I'll get to learn so much about the surface world. Don't worry, I'll be completely out of your way. I can keep your ears clean, too. Um. Okay. <laughs> We wish we could live with an adorable surface dweller, too. Well, the main tangle of roots is south of Feast. Our guards will let you through to see it. Best of luck to you, little wielder. Can I see this adorable bug living on my head? Should we go back to headband? Okay, bye. I like the different nose, yeah. Okay. Wait, so we can speak to all the bugs now? Oh, 
yay! Did you and the queen have a nice chat? She's really something else, right? It's very rare that even we get to speak with her. So don't take it for granted. We gotta go back to that cave with the spider. Oh my, what a lovely little creature. How do you like my antenna? And my sleek little skin dots? It turns out are weird. Are weird. Hi, pup. Welcome back to the human race. Enjoy your earth badge, your emotes, your ads reviewing. We're so glad to have you. Happy eight months. Happy Friday. Queen is cute. I don't know what, why I was expecting Hollow Knight Nightmare Fuel of Deepness. No, this is cute. Everything about it is cute. They must be overwhelmingly pretty for a foreigner like you. Grawia? It's funny how you cover yourself with those little cloths. Without those, you must be very ugly, I guess. <laughs> or does it help you hide from predators? I wonder so much about your funny surface culture. I love the little sounds you make. Oh, you're just so strange and lovely. This is a shortcut up to the surface world. Um, for bugs, I mean. I assume you can't climb up walls like this. Melaleuca. Sometimes I'm jealous of the littler bugs. They can discreetly come and go to the surface world, but there's no way I'm sneaking up there. I mean, here's better anyway. But sometimes I wonder. <laughs> Who else has played this game? I know a few of you have, but I feel like it's a little known gem. More, need more people need to play this. Especially if you're if it's not the sort of thing um, You would play on stream if you're a streamer like it's such a nice relaxing off stream game Or if you don't want to even do the plot and you just want to run around and color stuff Highly recommend Um, um, you're in charge of making all the tasty color, right? Just looking at your brush makes me hungry. Myconia? Not all bugs eat color, but I sure do. I was so sad when it suddenly disappeared. Please make as much as possible. Oh, it's so happy! Malva say? <laughs> okay. Oh, can you understand us now? Haha, <laughs> oops. <laughs> Cheeky. What are we betting that after we finish this chapter we can still talk to bugs? Or do you think I have to go now to talk to that spider? Otherwise I'll lose the opportunity. Oh, but if there was a park, or not a park bench, a transit bench, it wouldn't matter because we could warp back and then come back right away. Oh, look at this one! Do you know what this place is? When we reach a certain age, bugs come here to go into a hole for a while. While we're down there, we change and grow. It's how we become adults. The majesty of life and growth is here before us. Huh, we have a period like that too. I wouldn't call it magical though. Ardesia? Wait, do you say something funny if I wear my very adult costume? Where is it? Choosing your hole is technically meaningless, but it has a lot of importance to us. We like to say there's a right hole for each bug. I've never seen this. It's so colorful. I love it. Is the bug translating for us or is it sitting on our head giving us comprehension abilities? I think it's translating for us. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I found the soundtrack before I even knew about the game and loved it so much. I had to play it. The power of Lena Rain, Truly. Oh, did you all listen to the new Echoes of the Eye soundtrack yet? I haven't. It just came out today. It's not, it's not a new soundtrack. It's like additional tracks. Right? A ratatouille situation, maybe. Uh, do any of these holes feel like yours? 
So many stories come from these holes. For example, how do you know when you're ready to go? What happens when someone waits too long to get out of their hole? To go to their hole? I can recommend some great books on tales like these. Oh, but I suppose you wouldn't be able to read them. <laughs> Coming of age. Going into your hole. Cordia. Oh, I can't do it. I don't want to leave. Please don't make me. I'm not ready for the world out there. Everything's scary. But in my hole, everything's okay. I know I'm being a bit silly. I, I will leave here. Eventually, when I'm ready, just leave me be. Oh, trash. Doo -doo -doo. My favorite part of this game is the garbage. <laughs> I love collecting trash. Wait, so were we able to do anything here? Yeah, where does this go? This is how we came in. Grub deep. Oh, is this a... This is just a bench. It's not a transit bench. Bugatui. Coming of metam metamorphosis. I like it. There's the shortcut. Oh, I don't want to go back through there without the shortcut. Uh, we're gonna hope that we can still understand bug speak after this chapter once we have access to the shortcut. The brush hounds are very farty. There is an option in um, the settings to turn that off. <laughs> it says limit wet noises, a.k.a. squelches. <laughs> um, but we like them. Ixora is selling plants! Oh, oh my, hello! I've never spoken with a surface dweller before. Uh, this- wow. This is a very big deal for me. I'm a huge fan of your surface culture. I love collecting your, uh, litter. Fascinating, delicious little things. Do you have any? If you give me some, I'll trade things we've collected. Yeah, cool thing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I want your cool things. Wormy pile! Doo -doo -doo. You got flower stand. Ooh, look at that worm banner. Fungus table! Is this a computer? I must collect all the things. Dirt computer! Nematode hanger! Oh, I love it! Do you hear much about feast in your surface world? Not really, no. Not at all. Oh, I see. Well, you are quite mysterious to us as well. I've heard of bugs who went up to live in your world, but it must not be easy. Give me some litter and you can have anything on display. A cultural exchange. Very cute. The purchasing slash discovering objects noise is, is the best. Um, the little flute, wood flute situation. I know I expected her to say, Bafanada. <laughs> really wish I could use that shortcut, huh? We love a flute situation, absolutely. Oh, I can talk to you. Pingakula or something? <clears throat> Did you meet the queen? I'm so jealous. Isn't she amazing? Beautiful? I want to be as huge as her when I grow up. The queen is the oldest of all the bugs. She's so wise and great. I don't think anyone knows why she's so big and so old, but I hope she stays that way forever. The queen never ever leaves her lair, so it's pretty rare that anyone gets to see her. You have to be pretty important. I hope I can be important enough someday. You will be. Don't worry. 
then this screen I have to come back to because I don't have superpowers yet. Using my cat as foot warmer right now, I moved her over her favorite bed under my desk and she's like, I'll grudgingly allow you to share this with me. Aww. Hey Dakalib, welcome in. We are in Hallow Nest, yeah. We're in the bug zone. Meeting new friends. This is Sphagnum? I don't like these little black roots. These black roots. They say it's something that grew from above. The surface world must be a horrible place. I'm really worried. They won't say anything, but I think the roots are hurting the queen. She's so big. What if she got pinched? Poor queen. Oh, you have to color each of these bugs two different colors because then it shows their neat little spots. Wow. See the pattern on its horn? Wow, that's so cool. They don't have clothes. They have cool markings. I really want to go get that piece of trash, but I don't think I have the ability yet. This one I can't because it eats the color right away. <laughs> what about you? Wow! They're all nudists. Yeah, they already made fun of our clothes. Did we paint everyone yet? What about the little bugs in the hole? Okay, here. Ooh, you have stars on your pattern. And you only have the one color and some little white dots. That's okay. You're metamorphizing. Oops, okay. Wait, you wanna talk to me again? It's rare for the colored person to appear here, but they're probably the one surface dweller who comes because of a pact with the queen. It means more tasty color for us, so it makes us happy. Nice. They eat color. Yeah, this is where I need to go. Crinium. Hi, sorry if I came off as rude earlier. Past here is dangerous. I'm supposed to keep folks out. But the queen says you're okay. So you're okay. Go on ahead and have a nice day. I haven't even seen the growth much myself. I did take a peek, but boy, it's scary. I wouldn't want to be the one going in there. I've heard about your black trees. Never seen them grow down this deep, though. Something wild must be going on up there, hey? Yeah, it's pretty wild. So wild, it's time to change my outfit. Wait, can we update this? No. What should we wear for going into the growth? <gasps> Fungus hat. Do we have a mushroom outfit? Oh, I like this one because you can change the color of the shorts and the necklace. Oh, I like the wielder cloak though. Cute. Cute. Oh, the cape and the fungus that have to match, I guess. That's fine. We're here to do our job. Fungus head is OP. We're just a little mushroom dog. Oh, I guess I took it off so that the bug that's living on our head right now had room to breathe, but I think they're I think they're okay. Um 
Well, I'm stuck down here now, so that's concerning. It's one of the scary caves! Alright. Are we ready for a boss fight? Hopefully we get a new ability. These are usually kind of flashy, and, um... There might be a content warning. We'll see. And there's lots of eyeballs. Oh, look at our cool brush. Am I supposed to get it with the right color? This is like a puzzle boss fight. Can I change my color? No. I'm always yellow. Having a hard time with that last eyeball. Content warning, negative self-talk to skip. Um, we're going to continue, but we will have an announcement pinned in chat for when the content warning is over. We're going to talk to ourselves, our mirror self. This is what we saw happen with Chigory. I'm going to take a quick water break, too, if Ahmad could grab the content warning. And we'll go for it. <clears throat> yeah, I'd be freaked out, too, if I saw a mirror version of myself. This is, <laughs> this is Deep Nest. Thank you, Eric. Seafood, huh? Give it up already. What do you think you're doing here? I... I'm not scared of you, but I am you. I know everything there is to know about you. Look at you, playing the wielder. You really think you should be the one holding the brush? Well, no. But I'm doing my best. Chicory trusted me with it. Chicory? After what she said, you think she trusts you? No. She probably hates me. Of course she does. You're completely alone. And embarrassing yourself. It turns out, are weird. My boy, welcome in. Happy Friday. Thank you for the 19 months. Welcome back to the human race. Enjoy Earthbad, your emotes, your ad reviewing. We're so glad to have you. It's Friday. It's spooky because it's coming from your camp. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Here, let me move it. Sometimes I can drag the text boxes um, around the screen, but not for this fight. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> or maybe I'll go up in the corner. I don't know. This should be fine for now. <laughs> and embarrassing yourself. It's time we put an end to it. Oh, scary. Oh. Oh. I don't like... That hurts. I wish I could attack the, like, corruption. I don't think the purple hurts. Oh, if I move, they move. Oh, they're protected now. And they're not moving. This is hard. Oh, they're the other color again. And 
the music reverses when we need to do the other action. Oh. You're protected. How do I... How do I get you? Oh. Okay. Dang. He's chasing me. didn't get you. I thought for sure it would. There we go. Now I think we need purple. Oof. I'm lost. This part's hard. Things happening. I think I have like no fail mode on. Or we can fall down a few times before we get a game over, which I don't even understand how the game over works. Okay, speeding up now. Oh no! Oh no, they changed my line of symmetry. I'm not paying attention to where I'm standing. Gonna switch it again. Ooh. Rejoin with me. It's gonna be okay, dark, dark seafood. This is so weird and glitchy and woof. We made it. Yeah, I don't think it really has a game over, which I really like. <laughs> we did it! What a waste of time. I'm not going anywhere. The Black Forest will swallow everything, and it'll be all your fault. No! Wait, what? The source. <gasps> I have no color in this menu. Let's continue. Poor seafood. We gotta go get our brush. Your bond with the brush powered up. Can we climb walls? We can swim up vertical surfaces. Yay! Okay, we're back. But something's wrong. But we have bug powers. Um, excuse me. Did you take care of that black tangle? Yup. Okay, because... It would appear that in fact, nothing has actually changed or improved. Well, thanks for your help. You might want to talk to the queen before you leave. Interesting... Now can we go take the shortcut? I 
It has to be the right kind of surface. Not in here. The boss really messed with my head. That was tricky. That was really tricky. At, at least at a certain point, um, every time I hit the dark seafood, dark seafood, the mirror image, it had to be with the inverted color. But in the beginning, it was changing back where I had to do yellow and then purple and then yellow and then purple. That was really tricky. Where is the shortcut? It's like up in the upper right hand corner. Maybe. Aha. Whoa. Wow, you really can climb walls. You're pretty cool for a surface dweller. Thanks. Bye. Bye! I think there's a... a present on one of those walls. Oh, right here. Not a present. Some trash. We love trash. Whoa. This has a cool... gravity situation where if you don't keep pressing up... While you're climbing a wall, you start to slowly drift back down. Because, you know, gravity. Alright, where am I going? I want to find that bug... That spider cave. Was it near luncheon? Oh, I might not be able to find it. Yum cave, style maker, clothing swap, holy shop. Hmm. I forgot where we saw it. Oh shoot. I think it's above here, but I could be wrong. Let's try. Um, I should probably go talk to the queen. Now there's a spider I met once I want to go talk to. I'm afraid that we'll lose our ability to translate. We probably won't, but we're doing it anyway. The queen doesn't need us that bad, right? Oh no, look at all the tangles! Things are getting way worse. Oh, oops, sorry. Our poor friends. Hey Daxon, welcome in. Yeah, we're still going. We've been um up for like... Three and a half hours? We'll probably go to four. Oh, this is very scary. Oop. Can you let me pass? Is it you? No. I don't remember where they live. And that makes me sad. Wait, I can climb this wall now, though. I think. Hey, a present. You got a backwards hat. Um, if anyone remembers where the spider friend is, you can say that can be a safe word. Otherwise, we'll go back to the main story, I guess. We can put some furniture in our house in the meantime. <laughs> 
These are the essential things you do when the town around you is crumbling. It was south? Okay. Bro seafood. Well, we've got all these cool new objects to put in our room. We got a dirt computer. Do we have to put it on a table? Fungus table? <laughs> that looks very silly. I'm gonna put some of this stuff outside. All oh, smileys. I love it. You're the first dungeon. Uh, no. Oh, I hate the controls. How come that works sometimes and not others? The first dungeon was this one, right? I don't think there's a bench over there. Oh. No, don't take my friends! There's one here. Oh, hey seafood. I've been looking everywhere for you. Um, the Wielder Tower in Luncheon, it's, uh, something spooky's happening there. I mean, I guess it's not a rush, but, like, you should maybe check that out. If you get a minute. Okay. I'm going back home now. Bye, Pickle. I love Pickle so much. <laughs> Oh, this area. No, I don't think this is right. Oh, no. This is a mess. I think it has Pickle stationed there because they're like, if you're down here, you're doing it wrong. You're in the wrong zone. Although we can just like hop across stuff now, so that's good. Hmm. Scary tree. Oh no! I can't swim! <laughs> Think I can make that jump? No, I can. Okay, well, this has been a little bit of a failure. Wait, can we jump across this? Does that help me get to Supper Woods? Maybe if I swim through all these colors? Hmm, no, we just did a big circle. Well, I think there's a shortcut somewhere. Oh, I can get more stuff! Hey, missing kids are a bigger problem I realized. Even Peppers ended up here all the way from dinner somehow. Now she's helping me keep track of them, bless her heart. Pepper and I move more stuff out to make room. If you want some, it's yours. I gotta say, Beans is one heck of a gal. She's ready to take care of as many kids as she can. From the mess of her place, I thought she'd be a rough character, but she's got a huge heart. Going through those lost kid reports, it's heartbreaking. So many kids went missing. Almost couldn't get through all the reports. I was so upset by it. But someone had to do something. With Beans' help, I think we can do this. If you like any of the sets, interact with it and hand it over. I'm not sure what that means either. Look at all the kitties! Meow! Meow! 
Meow. You got painting supplies. Isn't it nice to get rid of that old junk? Yeah, I guess. I mean, I've had that stuff for so long, but it's easier now that you're here to talk me into it. I've got a new life to make space for. All right, I'll be watching the kids inside. If you find eight more, I'll move more stuff out. Okay. You can pet all the kitties. Yeah, it's the best. I think this is right. Oops. I didn't color any of this? I don't think I had the paintbrush yet. Or the, um, the bucket. No, this isn't right either. I'm not very good at finding where I'm supposed to go. But it's because we've already been here. Oh, it's raining up here. Da -da -da. This isn't where I'm supposed to be at all. <laughs> Tea time meadows. Hummus. Oh, hello. I'm just thinking here. Oh, content warning. Grieving illness, death of a loved one. Warning for chat. Also, maybe I'll put my webcam back where it was. I don't, I don't usually move it around mid-game, so... Oh, I moved something else. Well, that's where it's gonna stay now. You're the wielder, aren't you? I hate asking for favors, but well... It's my friend, he... He passed away just recently. We spent a lot of time together at this place. His final wish was to have a colorful garden here. If you find plants, can you bring some here? It would mean more than I can say. Yeah, we have tons of plants. Have you ever watched the gamer's Dorkness Rising? No, I have not. His name was Parsley. He was a really special guy. He loved plants more than anyone, so he always had more than he could handle. I've been such a mess without him. I keep coming here to think, but all I think about is how I haven't planted a garden yet. I don't even know where to begin with it. Just a few plants would be fine. Any holiday or any birthday, you could always count on Parsley to have a new plant for you. He knew so, so much about all the different kinds. He had a way of making you love them too. You don't have to help if you don't want to. I feel ridiculous asking for a favor like this, but if you do put some plants here, it would mean a lot. I don't know a, a thing about plants personally so when he got sick and said he wanted a garden here um well I didn't know where to begin I guess it was an overwhelming situation for a number of different reasons I've been such a mess without him I keep coming here to think but all I uh, I missed that one I think we we read that already Okay, first starting with some green grass. Okay, then get to getting you a little outfit. And then some plants. Cotton grass. I have five of them. And a seedling! I'm so glad I was prepared for this. I want to know what the seedling is going to grow into. Is 
Does that help? So cute. I also have more plants than I can handle. We got a lot of plants. This music is my favorite. Brecky. Oh, we can get to Grub Caverns from here. Oh, sneaky sneaky. I don't know where that spider is. I really wanted to find it. Thank you, Eric. I appreciate it so much. It's really worth it. I feel like it makes it extra taxing. But, um... If the game's gonna include it, I'm not, I don't want to just be like, Oh, well, there's the thing. Let's see where this shortcut comes out. Okay, so then maybe I'll just- if I can't find the spider right now, maybe I'll just ask safe word. Um, do we lose the ability to translate bug speak? Or do we get to keep that? Is that a limited time offer? What's going on here? Oh, I see. But I don't think- can I jump down there? Do I want to go up there? Yeah, there's a present. There we go. Studs! We'll wear that. I can't even see it. <laughs> How do I get down from here? There we go. Okay, well that's a look. Oh, we're gonna wear- wait, I messed up. We're what- we're what- we're gonna wear the black dress now, since we didn't wear it earlier. Black dress and studs. And I'm not gonna lock our colors, we, we're gonna change color. Is that an exit right there? No? Okay. You can climb this wall. the noises in here. Look at all this trash! Do do do! Okay, we gotta do it again. No! <laughs> Can't remember if Prunus leaves or not. Ooh, I want to go back and talk to the spider so bad. Can't find a definitive answer, but if I had to guess, I'd assume you don't lose it. Okay. I hate to keep you waiting for the story, just for this one spider. I googled to check, but got conflicting info. Interesting. I'll, I'll just have to check the VOD and then we'll know where the spider lives. Oh, I can climb up onto these things now, right? And talk to people I haven't met yet? Allium! Oh, hello! It's so interesting to meet a surface dweller. I can't believe you climbed here to chat with me. That's so lovely. Really, I didn't expect that. Why would you... Hmm. Well, I don't want to assume anything. But you should know, I'm really only interested in dating other bugs. 
I'm sorry, I feel awful about saying it. It's just, things are complicated, you know? I hope that wasn't disappointing to hear. You do seem lovely. I hope you find the right match for you down there. Or, uh, anywhere. <laughs> okay. Have a nice day. Apparently this is a bug dating sim now. Rejected by the bug, yeah. Feels bad. Oh, we can go up here now, too. I wonder if this bug wants to date us. Oh, is that you there, Prunus? Mm-hmm. I'm so happy to see you paired up with a wielder. Prunus is a really big wielder fan, did you know? Why he always used to say... <laughs> Um, sorry. I don't want to translate that. <laughs> She's being really embarrassing. Prunus and I are old, old friends, so I know how much this means to him. Showing him all your exciting surface world. But also, please be kind to him. I can actually speak a little of your surface language. Prunus taught me some phrases. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Wanna hear? Yeah. Hello. It's a nice to meet you. Prudus makes it sound so easy. That was very cute. I want to take your trash. Thank you. Okay, bye. Ah! Sorry, I've never seen anything like you. Fritillaria. Oh, oh my. Are those your eyes? How does that even... Ugh. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying not to be rude. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. I'm hideous. I know. <laughs> I guess we'll go back and talk to the queen now. Hi! What's up? Taking a look at those roots yet, dearie? Sure did. Sure did. But they haven't gone away. No. Come to think of it, whenever I do go into one of those spooky trees, they never actually go away. They just close up. Ah. Then it seems you must find the true source of the roots. The growths here are vicious. But they are only a symptom of the larger problem above us. That must be the only way to make them go away. The true source of the roots, but... Where could that be? How are we supposed to know, darling? But surely somewhere in the surface world, we are counting on you. We're so glad to meet another wielder. They come only so rarely, and truthfully, the last one we met wasn't nearly so cute. We have been... About for a long, 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 long time. But you little wielders seem to come and go so quickly. So sad. We always miss them. <laughs> we used to live up on the surface once. So long ago now. We were much smaller then. Things were easy. We remember the sun, so hot and bright. We remember the first wielder and their delightful colors. Ah, precious memories. I can paint you so many fun colors! Oh, you watch me walk back and forth like that. Ooh. You're getting awful close there! checked in the spider is a little way into supper woods going south from lunch and yeah we should go do that so we get to keep um prunus a little bit longer it seems 
which is good. Luncheon. I know this this game makes us hungry. <laughs> makes me hungry with all the names. What's over here? Oh, the phone booth. Okay. And what's over here? We need him so we can clean our ears. Yes, my favorite. I didn't shade in the background here. Like, I know I can't color the areas with these bugs, but have we gone to the right yet? No, don't go get that. Where are you going? I need you. We did go this way, cool. It's a smart Roomba, yeah. Brito, how's it going? Wait, did I ruin this? Puzzles. We've been through this area. Happy Friday! Absolutely, I'm glad. I'm trying to figure out. I'm getting better at, at drawing paths for those, but it's confusing at first. Let's go back to this. Let's go back to luncheon and try to find the, um... Wait, it's getting... Is it erasing our colors or I just haven't colored very much of luncheon? I don't know. I'm scared that it's erasing all of our artistry. Was it this path? Yeah, 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 yeah. I think this was it. Yeah. We can talk to Wisteria now. Oh, hello. So you can understand the bug language? Incredible. I came from Thies to live here on the surface. There's something about your surface culture that calls to me. Although mostly, I just meditate here. Make yourself at home, friend. I felt attuned with nature here on the surface. Of course, there's plenty to appreciate and feast as well, but we don't have the sun, wind, trees, and grass. I like to take things slowly here and meditate on them. It's not always easy being a bug here on the surface. My appearance can be unsettling to surface dwellers. I myself managed to get used to looking at folks like you, but it took some time. I try to stay out of the way and live peacefully. You... There it is. I love this little bug. Let's wear a hippie outfit. this look. Thank 
Thanks, Mysteria. That was lovely. <laughs> okay, I'm having some trouble with the controls there. There we go. <gasps> Big present. Oh, I think I see what I need to do. I can't get that high. Oh, maybe I have to jump? No. What is this thing? Oh, fun. I want to get the present. Okay. I almost messed that up. <laughs> A brush style. The style changes the shape of your stroke. I haven't even used all these new ones yet. Let's try them out. This one gives like a cool... We talked about it's sort of a... Oh man, look it! it takes me back to MS Paint and Kid Picks. And then this one is a explosion. Pow! 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 Bam! And this one means you can write in cursive. <laughs> cool. Kid Picks was my jam! It was so good. Those were the days. Okay. Now we... What else do we need to do? Is this taking me to a dead end? No, this is good, I think. We can climb up walls. We can go to that area north. We have to go face Chicory. Tough and fancy. I don't know what that means. And I like our outfit right now. Here, let's give you some more color. I thought we would maybe finish today, but I do think we're going to have to wrap up and finish it next week. Unless this is like the last, the very last thing. What time is it? Can I keep going? I can keep going. Let's maybe take another short stream break and then we can try to, to finish up. How does that sound? I just need a quick snack. Um, thank you for being here. This game is super cute. There's still a good amount left. Hmm. Yeah. Well, let's come back. Maybe we'll talk to Chicory in the tower. Maybe we'll just chat for a bit. And then, um, I still want to go for a tiny bit longer. Till like 4.30. 4.45, something like that. 
Here's our beautiful room. It's perfect. <laughs> Oh, how kind of you to color my home. Oh, but, um, it's really not very balanced. I'd like to see an additional color. Okay. How's that? How about that? That's all the colors I have. Okay, I'm painting this whole screen. Wait, the colors are different. Look at how you're, like, a bright cyan color right and this like pale pinky oh they told us the colors fade do they actually fade as you play the game and you have to go back into areas and brighten them up I mean that makes sense and the colors for this zone have changed since we started playing I want to look at my map. Or is everything just faded right now because of the condition of the world? It's hard to say just by looking at this if things are fading. Because this all looks very bright still and this was from the first day. But wow. The realism. Like, this green looks faded. I don't think it was that color when we started. And I painted them pretty recently. Okay, and now I'm lost. Can I even talk to you? Sh sh chicory? Can you hear me? Are you okay? I mean, I know you're probably not. Chicory, something horrible is going on. The black forest is sprouting everywhere, and it's starting to look and talk like me too. It isn't safe here anymore. Please, you have to come out. Chicory, are you? Oh, the door's open. <gasps> I'm scared. Okay, let me do some painting real quick to get my confidence back. Oh, creepy. I try to color and the colors disappear. Oh, no. Oh, this is the painting I did of Chicory, but it's inverted. It's the painting I did of Chicory. I didn't think she'd really hang it up. Aww. Uh. Upcoming sequence depicts a panic attack interspersed with self hate content warning for the upcoming exchange between me and Chicory. So you have that info and we'll let you know when it's over. I, I do feel it's interesting because I feel like we've seen much worse, much darker in other games. Although not very often because I feel like I keep my game choice pretty light. But, what's a game where it was really dark? Mm. I mean, Celeste doesn't have content warnings. And it, it gets pretty dark. To so, I mean, talking about self-hate, for sure. Talking about self-doubt and, and what is the other term they use when disparaging remarks or something like that is how they describe it. Anyway.
I do want to still play this sequence. We will let you know when the warning is over. Thank you for thanking the mods, Jeffrey. I don't- they're interesting and I- I don't want to downplay content warnings in any way whatsoever. I think they're important. I'm glad we have them. Um... I don't know if it's because it's more of a family game that they want those there so you can talk to your kids about it. Sometimes it seems that way, but that's coming from someone who is not a kid, doesn't have kids, and is not used to having content warnings in my game. Like, I grew up without content warnings at all, so it's like, well, yeah, of course there's going to be stuff that takes you by surprise, but I like having them there. As an adult. <laughs> All right, thank you for thanking the mods. I don't like that there's no colors here. Chicory, you came back. Chicory, you need to get out of this tower. It's not safe anymore. Something horrible is happening here. I'm what's happening here. I told you, all of this came from me. I'm just a broken, messed up person. You can't save me from this. The sooner you abandon me, the better off you'll be. Chicory, I... None of that's true. The last time I saw the darkness, it... Why won't you listen to me? Oh. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. Chicory. Oof. Oof. Okay, boss fight time. Oh, this is very Undertale. I can't do much right now either. I hear Lena <laughs> in this song. I hear Celeste Lena. The boss music is so good. Oof. Chicory, please listen! This darkness isn't just you. It started looking at speaking like me too. It must be something else. And why did it all come out when I had the brush? Why did all the color vanish? You think you did that? No, but... Stop making excuses for me. My entire reign as a wielder was a mistake. The only good thing I ever did was pass it on to you. Please forget about me. No. I'll just make everything worse. Oh, oh, you're chompy. Oh, I forgot that I can make this oh, bigger. Oh, the little claws! Oh! Ouchies! I don't know what's happening. We're back in it. Oh, the scratches got me. Chicory, you... You really think I'm a better wielder than you? Of course you are. What? When I saw that part of you in the swamp, you said you regretted giving the brush to me. I regret a lot of things. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. I don't know why I'd say something so stupid. Just another mistake. Nothing good comes from me. Why would you even want me around? Oh, ow. Ouchies. Mm -hmm. 
think I can do anything except dodge in this part. better off without me. All these problems came from me. I don't care where they came from. I can't face it alone anymore. I need your help. I won't abandon you, so stop asking me to. Please. I'm not going anywhere. I'm here. Just breathe. Just breathe. Think of the feather! Oh, I tried to make a heart. I wasn't quick enough. You... You've seen yourself in there too? Yeah. It spoke like it was me, and said stuff I was thinking, so something came from me. But if it came from you, and from me too, then it's from something common between us. It must have been... The brush. The brush? When I was wielding the brush, it's like it was connected to me. The more my bond with it grew, the more I could do with it to shape and color reality. But I wonder if it made more things real than just that. Seafood, I'm so, so sorry for whatever happened, uh, whatever you heard in the swamp. That's not who I want to be. When those corruptions talk to me, it's like all my self-doubts come to life. Reminding me of every mistake I've made. Chikri, you're so much more than that. It hurts to hear you talk about yourself that way. I forgive you, I just wish I could help. Well, more than that. I want to be your friend. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> I thought by now you hated me. I really like this game. <laughs> I thought you hated me. I'm so sorry. I just dropped you into this giant mess. I need to be better. I'm going to try. <laughs> but I need you to wield the brush. We can do it! <laughs> oh. New chapter! My emotions are leaking out of my face! <laughs> the wielder trials. I wasn't expecting that. This game is so good. <laughs> <laughs> Irrational laughter. Do -do -do. You can now paint and swim on water. The center of all the corruption and picnic is at the top of this tower. You can see for yourself if you swim up there. But you aren't ready to face it yet, because... You haven't become a proper wielder yet. I haven't? That's my fault. There's a series of five wielder trials. Well, one was the wielder temple, which you did. So, four wielder trials. One at each corner of Picnic. That's how you're meant to bond with the brush. And that's how you could reach the last step. From now on, I'm gonna be your teacher! I can't promise I'll be perfect, but I'm gonna try. Okay? Yeah, okay! I'm gonna fight the giant corruption. Bonding with the brush seems bad. What are the trials? Each trial explores a different aspect of being the wielder. You'll find one at each corner of Picnic. The aim will be to commune with the brush in different ways, so your bond with it is as strong as it can be. Okay. <laughs> I don't wanna ask the other questions right now. You look nervous. Ah, uh, I'm not. It's okay if you are. I was too. I was under a lot of pressure. I can do it. 
I want to be stronger. I will want to learn how to be a real wielder. And help everyone, and help you too. I can do it. Okay. Come find me at one of the trials. You can do it, seafood. Chicory, I love you! I gave you swim ability because you'll be drowning in tears at this point. Seriously. Oh, Duncan left. Duncan listened to the content warnings. It was too much for him. Okay. Poor trial is probably different emotional struggles. And afterwards, go to the top of a tower. Is it Machora's mask now? <laughs> It's interesting that it's trying our different- So do we have four abilities with the brush? Swimming through the paint on the ground, swimming through the paint on the wall, jumping, swimming in the water? Oh, and glow. One, two, three, four, five. But there's five trials and we already did one of them. Interesting. The, the first trial was the tutorial. Okay, well, that was a roller coaster. I missed some chat too, let me scroll up. Seeing panic attacks can give people who already suffer from the condition of panic attack. It's an important one. They're all important, yes. They are all really good. I think we, we, I, a lot of gamers probably get so used to not having content warnings and that's... You know, that doesn't have to be the norm. Um, it's definitely good to put that in there. To help people. Seeing chicory like this is heartbreaking. I love these survival bosses, especially with good music. I love the music. I love this boss because you can get a sense of like, wow, I'm multitasking, this is cool. But then there's not really any... I don't think the point of this game is to have that feeling of, oh yeah, I felled the really difficult boss. Like, it's to color and get through the message and the story, and it's lovely. Oh, I hate seeing everybody getting overtaken by the dark like this. Let's look at our map. So we can swim in this river now. Let's go for a swim. Oh, can I plant something in your garden? My precious little garden, it's got some unsettling new visitors. I don't think these trees are making my plants happy, but I don't even know where to begin with removing them. The roots run terrifyingly deep. Has the wielding been going okay, Seafood? I can only imagine the pressure you must be under. But, you know, whatever you do, I'll be rooting for you. I like to think tending a garden is like being the wielder. Caring for all these creatures' needs, creating and growing something from a blank canvas. Isn't that what it's like? Yeah, kind of. Here, have a seedling. Oops. It's blue. Don't worry about Macaroon, he's too tough to let the corruption get him, yeah? One thing I like is the website does the do dodgy? Dodge? Oh, does the dog die? I'm so sorry. I can't read. Uh, it has a list of content warnings for various video different games and movies. Mm -hmm. That's a good website. I've looked up, um, what, what game did I look up stuff in advance for? I mean, a couple, but most games, like Subnautica, there's not, at least the base game, a lot of dialogue. And you're like, no, this is mostly like ocean fear. You know, the content warning for you all for Subnautica is if you have thalassophobia, that is probably not the game for you. That's one that's, I didn't need to look it up to, um, to know that. But when it's emotional stuff, yeah, you use websites like that and it's nice that it's already in the, in the game. You used it for Stray, heck yes. I'm drawing a blank on what other stuff we use it for. 
Um, how do I get to this? How do I get to Sips River? I think I went the wrong way. I wasn't supposed to go through the garden exit. It's pink! It just makes it so much easier to get around when I color everything. I cannot handle the worst that could happen. Mm hmm. I feel that. This take us to Sips River? No, this takes us to Supper Woods. How do I get to Sips River? I want to go swimming. Did you ever play Hugh? No, I've not played Hugh. Forget to look up content warnings and trigger warnings for horror games, and it doesn't always happen, but there are times when I'm playing and I get to a point that I'm not comfy. One of the times was Bioshock. Mm hmm Go left for Sips River? Okay. I'm cool with taking directions. <laughs> oh, I was... Yeah, I was totally reading the map wrong. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That was needed. Oh, hey! Oh wow, this is kind of embarrassing. I came out here to study your work. I didn't think I'd run into you. Um, I'm not sure what to say. It's really nice. Thanks for coloring everything. Oh, it stays colorful. You add it to Discord later? Okay, nice. We're swimming! Are the trials all in the waterfalls? No, I can't go behind the waterfall. I like the color of the water. Me too. It's nice and um, muted. I like the muted water palette. He was good. Some of the puzzles get intense by the end. Yeah. Can I go under this bridge? Oh! <gasps> Secret under bridge compartment! What is this? Link to the past? Link's awakening? It's a present. Do, 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 do. Okay, yes, absolutely, yes. This is our new outfit forever. Colors are locked. <laughs> We're a dinosaur, rar. What do you think, Duncan? Oh, it turns out. Are weird. are weird. Shiloh's, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Welcome to the human race. Enjoy your earth badge, your emotes, your ad free viewing. We're so glad to have you. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Thanks for the hype. Double hype. Heck yeah. I really appreciate that. Brand new sub. Oh, I think we've been to this side of the river before. Yeah, yeah, we have. Let's keep swimming. I want to go to wherever the river ends, and then we'll save and quit. This is all new stuff down here. Well, sort of. We've been on land down here many times. Does this have an under the bridge compartment too? Dang! Sneaky! T-Rex body! <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, I was trying to col color the, um, the present. <laughs> Rawr. Thank you, Shilohs. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. I enjoy having you here. Just around the river bend. I don't think I can sing more than that. Copyright. Seafood isn't a dog anymore. We're a dino. Whoa, look at the critters! Oh, oh cool. I love the water color palette, the ocean one. The river's a little bit different, but then... Meg, hi! Welcome in! Have you played this game? It is such a treat. Look at these fishies following my brush! Come on, little fishy! Boop, I gotcha! All the fishies! We're gonna have a whole school. <laughs> I can't go further out, the waves wash me back. The big drink! This is new! Can I get up on the island? No? Not yet. Mysterious. Ooh, trash. <laughs> my favorite. Oh my god. I forgot I was wearing the T-Rex outfit. And I just see that little head poke out of the water. I'm like, oh, right. Do do do. <laughs> I haven't even heard of it. It's gorgeous. I highly recommend. It got a little emotional today. It's really good. Hi, Chicory. Do you recognize me? I'm a dinosaur now. Rawr. Here, let me color you in. Beautiful. Hey, seafood. Looks like you found your first trial. I guess I knew I'd take someone through this someday, but my memory of being on the other side is still fresh. I'll do my best, okay? The theme of this trial is finding your path as a wielder, or something like that. Locating this place is just the first step. There's a lot of old wielder stuff here. You'll have to find your way to the heart of the island. And, well... I'll leave the rest to you. See you up ahead. Okay, bye! Rawr. Rawr. Rex bod. <laughs> I went to color my coloring book, yes! Thanks, Chicory. I wanna look at our map. Oh, <gasps> it's so beautiful. We've got all this new stuff down here that's starting to get, get filled in. Human beings, it turns out, are weird. Hi, Engineer. Thank you for the resub. Welcome back to the human race. Enjoy Earth Badger emotes, your ad free viewing. We're so glad to have you. I appreciate you. 21 months. That's a lot of months. We went to the city today. We colored a bunch of the city. Yes. We yes. went to... Yes. Yes. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Grub caverns. Which grub caverns doesn't show us um, the painting we did there. Because it's underground. We did a lot of painting in grub caverns. Wonderful. I love the trails of paint through the places. 
pain. Trails of pain also. <laughs> Oh, and this is the little tracker for the kids we're missing. So there's seven over here. Dang, that's a lot. Maybe we haven't been there yet. Okay. I'm off early and brought wine. I'm ready for the weekend. Nice. I got a YouTube notice for your Subnautica VOD and I love the title. Oh my gosh. Okay, here, let me save and we're just, we're gonna chat. I wanted to show you the map before we ended. We got a bunch of new furniture today. We got our transit pass today. We got a new ability, two new abilities. Yeah, climbing and swimming in water. Um, I love it. Let's save and quit. <laughs> this little dinosaur outfit is the cutest. Hi, Jim. Welcome in. I wish it kept all the designs I've done on the opening screen somewhere. Okay, good job, Jen. <laughs> Thank you for watching, and be sure to check back for future episodes of Chicory. Thank you to this month's Kofi supporters, Mark C, 8-Bit Trav, Grey They, Paul, Shaggyfoot, Adam Extreme, Llama Flash, Ben Bird Person, Semi Cortex, Toon Wolf, Oracle the Great, and AVH4. Appreciate you all so much. Later.